when the previous Lord of Maidstone, a lowly lordship in the Riverlands, falls ill suddenly without an heir. He names his friend, a courtier named Duncan, his successor. Often counselling the Lord Sir Bryden in matters of state, Duncan was known to the court as just as a just and humble man who could be trusted in defending the people of Maidstone. So, a new house arises to the game. Its name, House Ander, whose motto, Vigilance and Respect, hopes to guide them through these dark times. Hello everybody and welcome to CK2, a Game of Thrones custom house. Yes, this is my own custom house, House Ander. Alex Ander, see what I did there? Its symbol is an owl on a uh, grey background, a golden owl on a grey background. And our first character is Lord Duncan, taken from my last name, Dunk. There we are, see? <laughs> uh, he has a little bit of OP stats, that's because I accidentally made him wrong. I didn't realise when I was making him. The um, These weren't adding things on the left, but they were adding things on the right, and I thought what was on the left was what I was going to get, so I added more things. And I made him a little bit overpowered, but we've got to get ourselves a little bit of grounding to start. We're going to start away. We're going to try to get married. Now, I'm going to play this a bit more roleplay than my other CK2 a Game of Thrones series, and I'm going to really get into my characters and make decisions based on what I think they would rather than what's necessarily best for the game. So we're going to search all. We're going to search for women. Not in prison. No, not in prison. Not married. Right. Uh, my religion. I'll try and find someone of my religion. Or just, just, just put any button. Search the realm. Actually, it'd be better, wouldn't it? Oh, we've got a strong little clansman here. Um, selfish. So we we wouldn't really want anyone that was wrathful or. We could deal with Proud, I think, because... Um, oh, I haven't even been through my stats. Hello. Right. We are a skilled steward. Um, we are quick, attractive, a skilled fighter. Uh, we have a pet sea lion. That has real-life connotations. I, myself, am said to only have a spinning sea lion gif going through my brain when I think. Um, we are just, brave, honest humble, trusting family person. So, we ourselves um, are quite a nice person. So I think we'd want to marry quite a nice person. So we're going to look for someone quite nice. Uh, proud, diligent, honest, envious. No, we wouldn't marry an envious person. Let's have a scroll. Oh, there's a quick girl. Ruthless, stubborn, envious, brave. Nope. Not our type of lady, I'm afraid. Uh, ambitious, diligent, shy, rough. Is the rough all just ruined it there? Um, what have we got? Proud, authoritative, brave, deceitful. No, the deceitful kind of ruined it there. Haze. Attractive, diligent, gregarious, patient, ruthless. What about you? No. Damn. Hmm. Ambitious. Uh, deceitful. Not really. Dun dun dun. dun. Elena Glenmore. Would not. Why not? We prefer a matrilineal marriage. Oh, fine. Uh, Weeping Bay. Felicia Piper. Trusting shy. Slothful. Uh, she wasn't slothful the last time this, I loaded this up. Um, oh well. Authoritative, trusting, selfish, diligent. Running out of really good people right now. Maybe, maybe we're being too fussy. Maybe we should be trying to marry out of necessity. Actually, there's kind, diligent hunter. What about you? 
Arrange marriage. <sighs> maybe we should unpause. Maybe maybe it's having a weird effect. Let's hit marry. See who comes up in this screen. No one really any good. Very, very little in the way of uh, brilliant people. She'd be great, but she's not old enough. Mm -hmm. I'm having wife troubles. <laughs> Trouble finding a wife. A whiffy. Kind, humble, temperate, shy. It could be someone. Go back to the character finder. Try putting in some just some good traits. Uh, so quick, let's look for quick girls. She's pretty good. Quick, ambitious, gregarious. The deceitful was kind of bad, but I think we could just. She would do it as well. You know what? We're marrying her. Um, I think we'd be, as a character, we'd be quite attracted to someone quite gregarious and uh, quite ambitious. Um, however, we're not very ambitious ourselves. We have been appointed this role by our friend who sadly died. Um, what is the Lord saying? To the brave charmer Duncan, um, we give you just a car. Yeah, I'll be a just a car. Let's get our thingies over here. Arwen. Uh, yeah, you can be our... So Arwen can be our Master at Arms. Uh, you'd make a good treasurer. Spy Master. Um, so Tristan, yes. Maester will be that guy. Septon, that guy. There we go. And uh, let's, let's also give these guys their jobs. You can scheme in Black Veil. Uh, you can... Pacify the province. We're at war. I think that'd be useful. You're going to fabricate claims on Fair Market. Uh, mainly because I think this is the next smallest air, uh, land in the area that we could possibly take in war. Um, we are going to go with War fo Focus. We're our country is at war at the moment, um, so I would believe we would do that. Uh, we will designate our wife the region as soon as possible. Uh, you, you can be master of the horse. You're a knight. You can be master of the hunt. High almoner, someone with quite high diplomacy. Florian, there. Cup bearer. Um, the septum. Bodyguards. We want people with trained in combat. You. Cleo, Hollis, Arwen, Maribald. Got quite a lot of knights in our land, which is kind of nice. Um, I'd quite like to become a knight as well, I think my character would. And let's get Florian. And then we need another commander. Cleos, I think, would be a good commander. Right, let's unpause. Our wife is on her way from wherever she was. I can't remember where she was. But yes, yeah, so I'm going to play this a little bit more role play. And our leech currently doesn't like us because of the sea lion, apparently. Um, Faith Militant restored. Oh. Faith of the Seven and the High Septon historically had two military orders known as the Faith Militant to call up in defense of the Faith. The warrior sons were made up of fanatical knights made from noble families who vowed to fight enemies of the Faith. Poor fellows were, mo were more humbly... was the more humble order made up of common folk and women. These lightly armed footmen protected the pilgrims of Westeros on their travels. Now the High Septon has 
acquired enough authority to restore the Faith Militant once more. The noble knights are flocking to join the warrior sons, and peasants are jo joining the poor fellows in their hundreds. The Faith is now truly a force to be reckoned with. Uh oh. Interesting. Yeah, there's our wife. She's quite powerful as well. I feel we'll be a force to be reckoned with. The king in the north. Yes, so our previous lord on his deathbed did tell us not to trust our current lord, giving us the orders to use any means necessary to secure Blackwood Vale and the lordship of Blackwood. Uh, I shall be a famous knight. Gains the train knight. In recognition of your glory and honour, a septon offers to anoint you with the holy and oils and grant you a knighthood. Can I just quickly select to become a knight? But yes, I'd become a knight. I've got a feeling that would be something I'd do. I'd become a knight. I will. I will. I will uh, support you. I feel. He does like us at the moment, which is good, though. But recently wed, and we're an exceptional military ruler. But we need our troops. Okay, let's boost. It's very good to get a knighthood that early. Yeah, I've had to do this um, be opening part of the Let's Play multiple times, because the first time I did it, uh, Lord Titus here um, kind of uh, slept with my wife, and uh, yes, yeah, so I'll, I'll, I'll have a look at those war games in a moment. Um, slept with my wife, became my rival, and then took my land, just randomly, and killed me, for no reason. Good. Uh, I've invited people to my court to take part in a war game which we will practice defending our land from invading enemies. We will use wooden models to represent invading armies, and I shall have to use very clever tactics to defeat my opponent. This will be fun. Uh, as we assign tasks for the war game, we put, we decide that Roger will defend with me, whilst Har Har Harbert will lead the invading forces. Let the best warlords win. At the beginning of the war game, the enemy quickly tries to advance up the hill of the area to strategical advantage, uh, bringing all our forces to the center. Confess, uh, rush forward with light skirmish forces. I would, I would rush forward with light skirmish forces. Okay, Harbour troops continuing uh, slow up, uh, continue a slow advance up the hill, pressing despite the assault of our skirmishers. Roger suggests that we climb uh, the hill fast. Um, Advance our main army to take the higher position than their troops. Circle around, slowed enemy, and attack from behind. Let's, um... Advance our army to take a higher position than their troops. High ground is always good. Our opponent's troops are clearly tired, and by using the high ground to our advantage, we quickly gain the upper hand. It is concluded that the defending team is victorious. Good game. I'm a student of strategy. Lovely. I also like our Maidstone's um, flag. The tower. The reason I picked Maidstone, by the way, it's a town near where I live in real life. Um, and I saw it and went, oh, hello. That, sound, that sounds glorious. So that made me a riverman. Um, position of commander? Yes, I will be a commander in your forces for now. Uh, levy shifted nobles. Okay, how is the war against Joffrey doing? Joffrey, we're currently winning. Brothers Without Banners Rebellion. Stannis Stormlands. Stannis is still fighting. Okay, the Riverlands. High Realm Authority. Uh-oh, that's a bad fight. 
That's the Riverlands army there. Hmm, the crossing. What a pain. So, our wife, her family, mm, there isn't one. Okay. Want to see if we could get an alliance anywhere. We need an ambition. I think our ambition right now would be to have a son. We'd want to continue our lineage. Lothiston. Hmm, let's see if we can get a claim over there. Take the advantage while we can. Just an independent area. Feel that would be something we'd do. We've been given direct orders by our predecessor and friend to make sure that the people of Maidstone are protected in any means necessary. And as they have um, disavowed, disavowed themselves and uh, not followed what we be believe is the righteous cause, I feel that gives us grounds to attack them. Or attempt to attack them. Harren Hall has become an independent. Oh, interesting. Oh yeah, Ambrose took over. Yeah, the Starks are doing bad engagements right now. I don't feel, feel the, uh, there is much longer for the Rebellion. I like that the South is currently using Anglo-Saxons and the North is using, um, like, Knights unit models. Surely it would be the other way around, in, in my head anyway. In my head it would be the other way around. Bing. 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 Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. So, trying to get that claim. That'd be nice. Got a fair bit of money. Hmm. Oh, we need to designate a regent. And that regent will be our wife. Who is with child as well? Didn't notice that. Decide upon with so you'll be presented with the. Yes, let's decide on my civil war side. Uh, the rebels. Yes, the rebel's cause is just. I'd be on the side of Rob. This is a marriage of love. This is very much a marriage of love, I think, Phil. We married a, a, a low more North lady. Well, look, we're like the opposite to the Starks. There's a North lady and a Riverlands man rather than a Riverlands lady and a North man. <laughs> Boost the speed a little bit. Wonder when she's due to be give birth. Uh, I will travel to the feast. I have a new heir. I'm gonna name him, and I'm gonna name him John. Our son, John Ander. 
thank you for having us. The succession of House Ander is safe, which is lovely. Um, I think we would want to have many children. Especially with our, our loving wife. Will there be a feast next year? Hmm. Maybe we should use some of this money to improve how many men we can have. Or build a castle town. Get the income coming in a bit more. No, let's get let's get patrol posts, I feel. Then a castle town. Intrigue. Hmm. These loyalists. Lord Titus is not to be trusted, apparently. You know, according to our thing. Oh, he's, a, he's going business focus. Well, he is. Um, okay. Upon the continuation of the long council meeting, you decide to make a toast. Of course, the toast becomes many time it seems to slip away. Later, you leave the council chamber. You stir and blow on your face, and you can feel the taste of blood in your mouth and dizziness setting in. Um, help? I'm in debt to that person. Okay. Hope I don't become a drunkard. Yeah, being a drunkard would be bad. Oh, would you look at the time. Thank you guys for joining me on this first episode of our Custom House campaign in CK2 A Game of Thrones. House Ander. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.